So hey guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back for your new. My name is Oodles and today I'm going to be doing a first reaction, first look at the new Sims 4 pack that has been announced. I think it is the Sims 4 Cottage Living. I'm so excited. I've been trying to keep myself from looking at any media or anything regarding it because I want to be surprised. I have a lot of theories and I know a lot of other Simmers have some theories too. So yeah, so first off, if you guys don't know, the other day the Sims team kind of announced a new pack uh, via the Game Changers. Each of the Game Changers were sent like a postcard that said, I think it was from Henford upon Badgley. I don't know. And that's where the speculation kind of started with everyone. Basically, it was a postcard from Agnes Crumplebottom. Well, I think it's like AG Crumplebottom, but we all know Agnes, OG. Um, and so, yeah, people started theorizing what the pack could be. A lot of people like myself are hoping for a farming pack because like I'm one of those annoying people that everybody hates in the Sims community because I really want a farming pack. And I think, you know, we need that. <laughs> I would love a horse. I would love, you know, some cows, whatever. I, I like the whole farming aesthetic but other people thought maybe it's like a cottage core theme pack because it was it did seem like it was based um in the english countryside like if you look at the postcard it does look like old english countryside and stuff like that even some people think it's going to be fairies which i don't really understand that one but i suppose so yeah i'm ready to see what it's gonna be i hope it's not disappointing so let's go ahead and get into it i'm so nervous well i'm not nervous i'm just shook i hope that it's good all right let's click play oh goodness okay it's given very sound of music oh is it a bunny oh he has a sweater on god is living in the back look at the bunnies i love bunnies that's so adorable Look at us finally getting new animals. Oh goodness. Hold on, let me turn the volume down a little bit. Aww. We got crops. I see pumpkins. Llamas! I'm not you getting bit. Look at the little chickens. It's reminding me of <gasps> embroidery. Oh, look at the fox. I love foxes so much. Not the llama spitting on people. You know, I would prefer an alpaca. I like alpacas. That'd be cute. Oh, look at the little chickens. You can, the cows can be milked. So it looks like we got new recipes and like baking or something. And the kids can cook. I just thought about that. We've never had kids be able to cook before. It's gonna be great. You know, I'm liking this so far. So is this like a farmer's market? We got watermelon, eggplant. Do we already have watermelon in the game? I don't know. Oh, he looks like a carrot. You know, I'm happy about this because, like I said, I'm one of those people that really wants, like, a farming pack. So I, not her getting into a fight with a chicken and losing. Oh, look at the little bunnies. I don't see horses. We got a rainbow cow. That's interesting. A rideable scenic commuting bike onward the adventure. No. Wait, 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 wait. Go back. Go back. Hold on. So I think these are like, oh, no, hold on. So buy by September 2nd to get Gnome on the go bonus content. Onward adventure, uh, adventurous Gnome statue, Bramble Woods, delightful tree. This is nice. The tree is given very like cottagecore vibes, which I love cottagecore. I love this. Okay, nice. And it's an expansion pack. So available July 22nd. Okay, so I like what I see. Like I said, I'm one of those people that loves like, I, I love farming and all the stuff related to farming. So this is great for me. I know a lot of people hate it. I know a lot of people are like, we don't need farming. We need cars. Like there's so many people that want cars, which I personally don't get, but I mean, live your best life. But honestly, 
I don't know. Like, I like it. It looks cute. I like that we're getting new animals. Finally, we're getting three new animals. We're getting bunnies. We're getting llamas. And we're getting cows. Um, I'm still one of those people that feel like cats and dogs should have included a lot more animals. I would have liked to see horses. But I guess llamas is on brand. Because, I mean, that's literally The Sims, like, branding. So, I guess that makes sense. But, personally, I would prefer a horse. Because I'm a horse girl. You know, always have been. Probably always will be. But hopefully the modders come through and they mod, you know, those those llamas into alpacas maybe or horses, modders, bunnies, please. I hope they do. The bunnies are so adorable. I love bunnies. I still, like I said, I feel like we should have already had all the animals and cats and dogs. I feel like my first pets should have been combined into it. I just, that's just me. Are you with your mama? But it looks cute. I like the idea of the farmer's market and, um the new baking or cooking recipes or whatever the new animations also the fact that children can cook i think that's really cute um i'm excited not gonna lie i can't wait until the pack comes out it's probably gonna be one that i buy on the first day i know it's gonna be buggy but also i feel like it'll be good in co um in combination with um arnie's uh open world farming mod too so i'll probably be using both of those in conjunction or because i know that mod comes out later on this month so it'll give us a month to play with that before um cottage living comes out but i like it it looks really cute so far like i said i'm one of those people that's always wanted a farming pack so i'm probably gonna be back to playing sims no lie <laughs> it's been a while since i've really had to play sims and i apologize i think it's storming outside if you guys can hear that but yeah, I can't wait to see the rest of the trailers and the rest of the content that's coming. I'm excited. Hope that the gameplay is given all that it looks like it's going to give in the trailer. And yeah, that's all I have to say right now. I can't wait to, you know, finally be putting Sims content back on my channel. I'm excited. And I hope this pack like really, you know, does what it looks like it's supposed to do. If you guys like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you're excited for this pack or if there's anything you can't wait to do in this pack. If you wanted a farming pack, are you disappointed? Are you happy like me? Let me know down in the comments down below. And if you want to see more of this content, make sure you subscribe and hit that notifications bell so that you'll know every time I post, I'll be back with some Sims videos really soon since that's how my channel started and I'm kind of getting back into playing the game. But yeah, I love you guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.